What's good, YouTube? Born Goat TV here, back with another one, and today we have Ren Money Game Part 2 official lyric video. Now, I've seen in the comments not to do the music video because it's shorter, so that's why we're going to be doing the official lyric video today and see what Ren has to say on this one. Obviously, I thought the first one was really good and uh, curious to see where the, the trilogy takes us. So... With that said, I would like if you guys could like, comment, subscribe, share the video, do anything you can to spread this around and keep growing this family as organic as possible. And let's keep having conversations in the comments and being positive and loving and just nothing but the best for everybody and just know that I am so appreciative of everything that you guys have done and continue to do for this channel. And uh, yeah, I'm just very blessed and can't wait to continue this with you guys. So with that said, let's get right into it. Um. Um. Panic and hysteria Poor man, learn the rich man don't care for your Narcissist mindset spread like malaria Sit back and watch the show America written split through fickle shit A government of hypocrites These counterfeit politicians sit in parliament Not adequate Come on. Needlessly bleeding resources all dry Turn a blind eye if it means a pay rise Oh what a shame it would be I would die If number 10 Downing Street burned in a fire Only joking, only messing don't be stressing, I'm a peaceful adolescent There's no need to be unpleasant Write my thesis in a rhyme scheme To analyze the brain While my finger's on the trigger of a money game Oh, rain, 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 rain The storm, it comes that way And I'm no surprise to distorted lies Poison in the face But we die upon the blame, 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 blame It's easier to blame We point the mirror at ourselves We're all part of this whole money game So as I've said before, you know, coming from the military and have my military background, there's so much that, you know, I've seen and done that personally, you know, I've come to grips with because there's certain things that the government doesn't want you to know. And there's reasons for that. And you see it on a small scale in the military and it's much bigger than what we even see but you kind of get more of a gist than it than just your average person now anybody that is you know educated to the point where they kind of know where everything sits kind of like a wren or you know most of you guys in the comments, you guys are aware that it, the government doesn't have your best interests at times or really at any time, you know, because it's all a game. It's, it's a he said, she said game, bunch of lies. It's, it's really just to get your vote to continue their narrative of what they want to do. And they feed off of most Americans that believe their lies, you know, it, and like he said, it's the, you know, you're pointing fingers, trying to put the blame on people. And that's the majority of it right there in itself. You know, there's a reason why certain things come up each four years in America for election season. And it's to point the blame on somebody else and to spin the narrative into their favor. And it's a really sad concept, and it's sad that we buy into it as, as the average people of America. Because, and I get it, th this happens all over the world, but I live in America, and this, you know, I'll speak on that. And 
it's just sad because if everyone just kind of opened their eyes and banded together and and didn't fall into what they are trying to to push you know i think we would have a better chance of just banding together and making an actual change rather than continue the process of everything that we do each and every year of just following a bunch of lies and it's like they just want to make you look this way while they're looking that way on other things. So look at this small thing while we control this really big thing right underneath your nose and you have no idea about it. So it's sad to see in that aspect because <clears throat> we just turn a blind eye to it and we, you know, most of us don't even know what's going on because they're doing what they want to do successfully by making you look over here and follow something that shouldn't that's it isn't really even necessary you know it's in the grand scheme of things it's not you know it's nothing that should be looked at like that it should just be you know why are they trying to get our attention over here you know because they're trying to do something over there that's what the real issue is and that's what we fail to see every day as americans and it sucks because i i wish it was different and i wish not everyone would just kind of feed into that but it happens and that's kind of what ren's speaking on here and the ladder we climb turns a saint into a sinner with his finger in crime I'll break uh, it down for you motherfuckers line by line This is business economics in a nursery rhyme uh, She sells seashells on a seashore But the value of these shells will fall uh, Due to the laws of supply and demand No one wants to buy shells cause there's loads on the sand Step one, must create a sense of scarcity Shells will sell much better if the people think they're rare you see Bear with me, take as many shells as you can find And hide them on an island stockpile I'm high until they're rarer than a diamond Step two, gotta make the people think that they want them, really want them, really fucking want them. Hit on Mike Bronson, influencers, product placement, featured primetime entertainment. If you haven't got a shell, then you're just a fucking waste, man. Free, it's Monopoly. Invest inside some property. Start a corporation, make a logo, do it properly. Shells must sell, that will be a new philosophy. Swallow all your morals, they're a poor man's quality. For expand, expand, expand. Clear forest, make land, fresh blood on hands, five. Why just shells? Why limit yourself? She sells seashells, sell oil as well. Six on, sell stock, sell diamonds, sell Rock sell water to a fish, sell the time to a clock seven Press on the gas, take your foot off the brakes They're on to be the president of the United States A big smile, make big wave, that's great Now the truth is overrated, tell lies out the gate Nine polarise the people, controversy is the game It don't matter if they hate you, if they all say your name Ten the world is yours Step out on a stage to a round of applause You're a liar, cheat, a devil, a whore And you sell seashells on the seashore Rain, 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 rain The storm it comes our way And those who rise to distorted lies Poison in the face But we die upon the flame, bang, bang, bang It's easy out to blame We point the mirror at ourselves We're all part of this whole money game Yeah, so he's pretty much bringing to light everything that, you know, that I kind of speak on and a lot of people speak on really, but not enough. Greed and wealth, money, like it, politicians, stock market, it all goes hand in hand and it's really a crappy thing because the bigger you are, the the greedy, greedier you are and... It's all a part of this, the system of putting the blame on other people so that way you don't get caught in all the lies and schemes that you're doing behind everyone's back. And a lot of these rich politicians and stock market people, you know, they don't, they don't do the same things that we do as Americans. The, 
the day-to-day Americans of paying taxes and doing all that. They get away with so much crap. It's unreal. Like, And we just let it happen and sit back and don't pay attention and we're oblivious. And we really just... I, I wish it wasn't a thing. I really do because it's so sad to see on a day-to-day basis and we are the ones that hurt from it not not them they're good like they won't ever get caught in all the scandalous things that they do i mean look at biden and clinton and hillary clinton and bill clinton you know george w bush senior junior trump like all these people they do so much lying and scandalous things and it's just like well this person does this for me and so i'm gonna vote for it's like no they're telling you that they're not going to do it it's a lie it's almost like when you were in school and you had like a school president or class president whatever it was it's like these kids would tell you everything that they wanted to do for the school and for, you know, do this, this, and this, but it, they're not going to be able to do it. They can't do anything because it's not their place to do it. It's the people in the back that you don't see that are pulling the strings. So it's like they can promise you everything and anything, but it doesn't mean it's going to happen, but... We, as the normal people, just go, oh, man, this is what they're going to do. Okay, thank you. And are so oblivious to everything else that they're doing right under our noses. And it's just sad. It's very sad. But with that said, I really enjoyed this. I can't wait to uh, get to the third part of this. And uh, let's talk about this in the comments. I want to hear what you guys have to think about this song. And... uh, I love your guys' faces, and I'll see you on the next one.